What happened in this house behind me is simply a nightmare. And there are a lot of deeply disturbing questions for authorities here. So far, no identities on any of the victims, but we do know that six of the 10 bodies are those of African-American women. The investigation here is just beginning. Police are going to go through this house inch by inch. intro, make sure you say alleged serial killer, not mass murderer. Uh, we're asking for the public's help in identifying and locating actually the suspect wanted. He's 50 years old, black male. He stands up six feet tall, 155 pounds. Anyone with information on his whereabouts is asked to call uh, the sex crimes unit. Probably the next 15, 20 minutes. Might be the most important 15 minutes of your life. What we're looking for is to be honest with us some more. Okay. What right now? I think you know what I'm talking about. Okay. If I told if I can help, and I'll, I'll try. All right. But let's let's just get this over with and talk about what's going on in your home. Now you know we've been to your home. Okay. What? 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 what is that the question? Okay. Um, upstairs on the third floor we stay. We found found some folks up there. Yeah. Now, hey, I know stuff. You know, you you know, you're running with some some people that you know are kind of fringe folks. But again, it's real important. You're honest with us. You know, you know why you're down here. So, what happened up there in that third floor? I met him when he was dating the mayor's niece, Lori. And he worked. He was different then. And he wasn't looking scraggly. He wasn't really getting high. No, he had a job. He's actually, you know, quote unquote, a taxpayer. And when I went over to his house, and he used to try to get me to come up there. I hadn't been up there. I slept there. He didn't fed me. You know, I understand this why. The people across the street didn't notice this. How come someone, I mean, they notice everything else. Can this go on for so long without the police department getting more involved? We will not know until we identify the victims and understand their way of life, how they existed in the community.